Okay, I just thought I'd take one more shot here before I uh, call it a day, just in case. Um, so this is me with the, my weight on the hitch and the bottom hole of the triple attachment pulley. Being used for the steel beaner from the hitchhiker. And with weight on it, you can see how it clears. When I put slack in it, though, and, and tend slack just by walking forward, that's when it bumps and it takes a little bit of the paint off, but it doesn't. I'm pulling up on it, tending it. I'm going to walk back a little bit. This is my over the shoulder webbing strap that ties on the back side of this horizontal portion. And that's tending from the top hole of the triple attachment pulley with a beaner. And the middle hole is what attaches me to my bridge ring. So now, now that I've been using the hitch, when I first hooked it up, it was stiff and tight. Uh, now I've been running on it for a while. Now I can just walk forward, pull up one handed easily. I guess maybe it does uh, make a little bit of noise, but like Paul Cox, the inventor of this item, was saying. But I guess I'm not that uh, religious about wanting to keep the forest quiet. I just... Uh, I'm just looking for something that works for me and with this setup if I want to pass this whole system around a branch I just have to lanyard in put a little slack in the system I'm doing this one-handed now just took the beaner off I can just take the whole system just like it is separated I would I would normally clip small beaner like this to my uh, rope bridge below the hitchhiker so that uh, if I drop it it's not going to go anywhere it's going to hit the beaner and stop and that was uh, Fiona that gave me that tip which I appreciate from Bermuda and so you pass the whole system around the tree on the branch you want. Pop spring loaded clevis just pop loose that easily. So I'd swing that around. So I got my bungee attached. So swing it around, grab it. I'm doing all this one hand because I'm holding the camera with the other hand. Grab a little slack. Clip it in. Back up and running. Put my rope on the other side of the branch. Just pull up some slack. It all one handed except for that last little bit. So, I guess that demonstrated what I'm trying to demonstrate.
see how that's feeding through the pulley. As I'm walking away. And then I want to pull some slack. Because there's no tension on the line, the pulley tends to bump just slightly, but it's a little bit limited by this other beaner, I guess. So I'm just pulling it up one handed. Sit back in it. In it. It's got my weight. And that ought to do it.